NASA through the eyes of an 18-year-old is a video that I shot in 1994 um, while I worked at the Kennedy Space Center. Actually, I won an award through um, work with fuel cell, uh, working with fuel cells from 7th grade to, to 12th grade, um, which, in, which enabled me to uh, work at NASA, um, Kennedy Space Center, for uh, three and a half months or so during the summer of 1994. Uh, while I was there, I was given the opportunity to see a lot of different aspects of the Kennedy Space Center and to take some pictures and shoot some video. So anyway, this is the video and a compilation of pictures for your enjoyment. This is part one of a series of, uh, of uh, videos. Columbia. Uh it's the 7th of July, 1994. It's going to launch tomorrow on the 8th. Um, it's sitting there on the pad, ready to go. It's launching, uh, well, tomorrow at 12.43. It's another view of the other side of the uh, space shuttle. Actually, you see more of the uh, launch platform there, but all those lights are lighting up the space shuttle Columbia, ready for launch tomorrow. where the uh, video starts getting a little bit random. This is, uh, these are scenes from the office in which I worked uh, at the Kennedy Space Center. Uh, just bear with me, it's, it's kind of funny. Listen to some of the, the, the narration um, in the video. You need like a PhD to operate that phone. Check out this flow diagram. This flow diagram is like directions on how to do it. I still haven't quite figured it out. I got the voicemail part working. To start. NASA office fan. Uh, highly technical, highly calibrated. Uh, anyway, just a million and a half for that one. Got the tour buses down there. That's the average Joe Blow tour. And there's the uh, Saturn V, which uh, supposedly in about 10 seconds they're supposed to do a uh, static main engine test and blow the crap out of that bus right there, but oh, he, he's moving them back a little bit, it'll be okay. Uh, these cars down here will perish, but, but that's okay. Uh, anyway, um, they're going to do a, a horizontal test flight of this uh, pretty soon. Hopefully the pieces will reassemble uh, as the main engines ignite. We'll see. Oh, they had they had a delay of launch. I heard it on the, the uh, radio behind me. Looks like another ten minutes it'll launch. So we'll see. Anyway, that's that's launch pad uh, A. That's where the uh, last shuttle Columbia, which is in space right now, as we as I am speaking, uh, at 1:50 uh, Friday the 15th of of July. That, that's where it launched from. Uh, over here, that's the, that, that right there is the LCC, which stands for Launch Control Complex. That's where they launched the shuttle from. Let me figure. And over here is the, uh, the, the vehicle assembly building. 
used to be the largest building on the road, but uh, it's not anymore. So let's see, it's 500, 535 feet tall. And it's very big inside. It's all like one big open building. Anyway, that's OPF Bay yeah, 1. Those are the OPFs. <laughs> OPF Bay 2. And that's OPF Bay 3. That's where the orbiter is. That's why it's called the Orbiter Processing Facility. The OSB stairway. Wow. Check it out. Sleek.